suck my balls. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? <laughs> what's cooking, everyone? What's up, guys? It's your boy R City Four or Relax City Four here. Say hi, or not mine. We here with something a little bit brand new. We're doing a cut commentary type of thing here. We're playing a uh, Gross in the House. I think it's how you pronounce it on World War Two. It's or the, it's like the small map. Uh, and yeah, we're gonna do a cut com here today, I guess. All right, to first start off. We're gonna talk about how I. Oh, yeah, except that does hurt a lot. We're gonna first start off by how I got bit, how I'm getting bit by a dog almost every day. You're like, Austin, what the fuck do you mean you're getting bit by a dog almost every day? Well, first, it's for the it's for police training. We're training a K. Uh, we're not we, not in like me, but uh, the police station here is training a K9 for uh, K9 units and stuff like that. And uh, they hired me. They didn't hire me. They just oh my controller's low on batteries. They uh they offered me to like hey you want to get bite by a dog for free and I was like yeah sure does it hurt they're like no it's not gonna hurt and it fucking hurts a lot actually it hurts hurts quite a bit because this dog isn't just a tiny little puppy it's things freaking big it's like 150 pounds or so something crazy like that he's just it's a giant a black German Shepherd just absolutely massive uh, one of my favorite things is when I was um <laughs> when I was getting bit by the dog I was running. Right, and I, I have one of those fast, not one of those fast suits, but the one of those suits where they put on for you to make sure that when they bit, it bite, it doesn't hit your skin, it doesn't bite through, it doesn't go through the skin, stuff like that, but you get some bruises on your arm and stuff like that. Uh, but one crazy thing was, um, but the crazy thing is, so I was running it from the dog, right? And I got freaking fell flat on my face. Like I was running, it grabbed my arm, and I fell completely flat on my face. It was, it was absolutely hilarious. And, like you can't protect yourself because your arm is caught your arm is like getting carried by a dog so i just had to fall right on my face another thing i want to talk about is um oh my god so we were planting so we were planting drugs to help the dog like you know to get him certified and like drug searching thing and all that we, so we were planting drugs and like i <laughs> i didn't think it was because like, we have the drugs i thought it was just like the scent of it but no it was like legit meth like i had like 20 grams of meth in my hands that was insane like it's crazy to think about because like people would die people would kill to have 20 grams of meth that's, that's a lot of money from that's a lot of meth to say the least it was crazy and the crazy thing about that i'm sorry i can't i'm what the fuck was that my fucking phone fell that's fucking weird <laughs> there's a ghost in my house another crazy thing we're finally i can finally talk about it is uh we have, i'm gonna have to do building hunting oh my fucking god my phone is back on it again but crazy thing is we're gonna have to do like i'm gonna have to like dress up in like a costume like the same like bike costume and then put like drug scent over me or something like that so he can come and find me in the building which that's gonna be really, really exciting to do another thing i want to talk about it's not not another thing i want to talk about i know it's really weird is like i'm not used to doing cut comps at all and like, i want to get better at them because i find cut comps actually like really really entertaining to watch and listen to and stuff like that and i'm not used to it at all so like what i did was i write everything i want to talk about on a piece of paper just like write down the basics of it and i <laughs> I, I don't know if it's working or not like, I just want to get used to doing cut comms because like watching people there's this youtuber his name was Voltsy. Um I saw I met him on Xbox he was I really enjoyed his channel he's at like 500 something subscribers and he stopped doing YouTube and deleted all his photo well, photos videos which really suck because I kind of wanted to make videos similar to his not exactly like his but similar to his I guess you can say and it was just really, um, it really sucked because I wanted to, it was, his videos were really entertaining to watch. And they were just simple cut comps, they were just, the next thing I want to talk about, I know you guys probably have heard it a lot about it, the NBA draft. So I was watching the NBA draft, and I'm kind of upset because, you know, DeAndre Aiden went first, which is, that, that was what should have happened. And the Suns absolutely won this draft. They got, what, Mikael Bridges, I think it was, with DeAndre Aiden, which is crazy. What really makes me mad was Luka Doncic, man. Doncic, Doncic, I'm gonna pronounce his name. He's he's freaking fantastic. I love Luka, but um, I'm not over. I, I feel like I might be over him, but he's a great. He was he was great. You know, he's super young too. But Luka, right? He got drafted by the Hawks, and then they traded Luka to Trey Young, like with Trey Young. And like, don't get me wrong, Trey Young's a fantastic shooter, amazing player. Better than I could ever be, probably. But they traded Luca, which is like, which is a much better prospect in my eyes. It has more potential. Oh shit, we're getting caught in a pickle. Which is a much better prospect in my eyes than Trey Young is. The reason why I think they did that trade, the biggest reason is because it's kind of like it was kind of a business decision because Trey Young has the most hype out of everyone, like out of everyone on this. Uh, what's it called? Out of everyone in the draft. So I think they kind of did it to kind of fill people back in to come back to. 
the come the come the, the come <laughs> to get the Atlanta fans to come back and come back and fill the seats. Oh, I cannot talk. And the last thing I want to talk about is lastly but not least, but crazy to me is Michael Porter Jr. MPJ over here fell down to the 15th or like 14th spot. He went to the Nuggets, and if <laughs> the crazy thing is, if he turns out the way like it looks like he's gonna turn out, like turn out like just really like a really, really solid fantastic player the nuggets might have gotten the biggest steal in nba history because what like last year i think it was michael porter jr was predicted to go number one overall like they, they have a number one overall talent type guy number one overall talent guy Ooh, sh fuck 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 a number one guy that has like a talent of a number one overall pick and got him at the 15th 14th whatever pick it was which is just insane to think about well, that's clutch. That just blows my mind, honestly. I really hope he turns out because I'm not a fan of the Nuggets. I'm a fan of the Jazz, but still, I I don't wish bad on any team except the Lakers. I'm I, I don't mind the Lakers. The Lakers are cool. Right, the next thing I'm gonna talk about. This is the last thing we'll talk about today. Is so I went swimming yesterday, right? And I'm just gonna explain how this is. So basically, since I'm in Nevada, right, we don't have a lot of clean water to say the least. It's like extremely dirty. It's like muddy, and there's like oils and stuff at the bottom. It's absolutely, it's not oil, but like it's absolutely disgusting. You can't see freaking six feet in front of you to say the least. The crazy thing is, right? So we went there swimming and stuff like that, and like it's so we call it silver, but the thing is, it's directly, it's literally a railroad bridge. Like trains cross it like every few hours, and it's crazy because. We were swimming and a train literally was maybe two feet away from me and it's just crazy because they're I, they're absolutely massive like they really are oh he's online they're apps trains are huge like being that close to them to see how fast they're going it's crazy to think about oh then not only that freaking so i was so up uh, so i was sitting down on like this ledge kind of and i was throwing rocks and your boy austin over here is a little, kind of a dummy and there was this little, there was a little pool at the use. I don't know what they use it for, but it's like one of those, it's one of the pools you like stick in the ground to wrap things around, I guess. And I fucking threw a rock, and I totally niched my arm on it, and like, I cut my elbow like right open. It, it was bleeding bad, and I said, screw it, just grab me a towel. It was real bad. It was like bleeding everywhere. I'm okay though. I, I think I'm okay. Hope I live. Super glue it. And the last thing I want to talk about is that when we were swimming, we found a bunch of, uh, we found. So basically, the water's not deep at all. Like, not at all. Like, it's maybe six maximum. There's, like, a maximum of six feet area. And I'm 6'5", so, like, it doesn't... <laughs> I can touch everywhere. So we were finding a bunch of sticks because we were bored. And we built, a, we built, like, a giant stick for it. We probably put, like, 150 sticks in this little shallow area of it. And it was just, it was fun. It was crazy. And we used moss as the roofing. <laughs> it was crazy. It was fun. I don't know if I'll probably, I don't know if I can find it. I'll, if I ever find, I don't know if it's even there anymore because the current's pretty strong. So if it's still there, I'll probably take a picture of it and put it in the next video. All right, guys, that is all I have for you guys now. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the cut com type thing. It's, it's a little different. I'm sorry if the uh, gameplay is a little choppy or whatever. It's because the stupid rocks it just sucks. I'm about to buy a new capture card pretty soon. Right when I get back from Atlanta, I'm probably gonna go buy it. Right, guys, and that's it. That's all I have for you guys now. Make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, do all that crazy funky stuff, whatever you guys do and i'll see you guys probably in a few days probably like tomorrow i don't know i'm gonna try to start uploading a lot more sorry about the whole big wait or whatever but uh, hit the like button subscribe snort cocaine